hey guys welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys my summer curly hair routine this routine has really been helping my curls last all summer unfortunately it's been really humid these last few days so this hasn't worked in humidity like that but overall in the summer this is a little cocktail i've been doing and my curls have been lasting so the first product i'm going to be going in with is the main choice four leaf clover manageability and softening remedy leave-in spray now this spray smells a little bit strong for my liking but i still use it because i really do like how it works in my hair i spray i spray this generously throughout my strands to make sure that every single strand is coated with product i'm using my tangle teaser brush here to just evenly detangle my hair and all that good stuff the next product I'm going in with is the Sotanicals, of course, you know I couldn't leave them out, Marula Melon Moisture Guru. And this is actually a new product I've been using this summer because it's, I, I believe it's only a summer product, um, but I love, love, love the consistency of this cream. It's a styling cream and it works really well on my hair so far. I've used it a couple times already and I really do like how it moisturizes and hydrates my hair especially for the summer since the sun can really just dry out your curls this works perfect the gel i've been using lately that i have been obsessing with i actually already finished an entire tub is the main choice tropical moringa sweet oil and honey endless moisture pearly braid out glaze now it's not really a gel but i mean it works like a gel and they called it a glaze but honestly it's like the perfect gel now my only advice when using this gel is not to be heavy handed. I've learned that the hard way because you guys already know I am super heavy handed with my products. Don't be heavy handed otherwise it will feel sticky and just weird. So after I coated my hair with those three products, I go ahead and use my handy dandy Denman brush. The Denman brush is my best friend. I love using this while styling my hair, especially in the summer you guys actually. I noticed that while using the Denman brush, it kind of mimics finger coiling like I, sh I shared with you guys in my other video. And my curls last much longer. They look really good and healthy. So I always use the Denman brush in my routine. By the way, I apologize for the quality of this video. I don't know what went on with my camera, but I love the way my curls turned out. So I didn't want to refilm it. I hope that's okay, but you can still see exactly what I'm doing. The quality is just a little bit meh. So after I apply all the products, rake the Denman brush through, I scrunch my hair to get all that excess water out, and then I move on to the next section. So I didn't show this in the first clip, but I always start by wetting my hair with lots of water. As you guys already know, I like to style my hair with soaking wet. Well, I like to style my hair while it's soaking wet because I feel like it gives me the best results. I'm going to be repeating the same exact steps using these same exact products throughout my entire hair. I'm working in really small sections. This is like the major key to not having any frizz. It's not always so much the products, although they do contribute a lot to your results. But honestly, the technique that you use to style your hair is what's going to give you a frizz free look. If you don't like to use a Denman brush or any type of brush, I would still recommend to you, I would still recommend for you to style your curls in really small sections. That way you're not missing out on any strand and they're all coated in the products that you are using. Now, a lot of times people don't understand why I use three different products. And I kid you not, all these products do something different. So I always go in with a leave-in conditioner, a styling cream and a gel. In the summertime, I always use a gel in my hair because, hello, <laughs> the heat, if you don't have a cast that's gonna hold those curls, they are gonna be flying everywhere and they're just gonna be super frizzy. So oh, I always make sure I use a gel in the summer to top my hairstyle. So the leave-in conditioner, just give you a quick breakdown. The leave-in conditioner keeps in that moisture. The styling cream helps hydrate and define my curls while the gel helps hold that definition and it sometimes even adds more definition and it allows my wash and go to last much longer so again i'm just going to be repeating the same exact steps and i am going to show you guys how i style the front of my hair which i usually get a lot of questions on how i do it how i style the front of my hair without getting any parts i think i've mastered this already because i did struggle with styling my hair and always having some kind of permanent parting 
for that entire week and I really didn't like that. So I'm gonna show you guys in a little bit what I do to avoid any permanent middle part. Oh, another thing I forgot to mention is that I've been scrunching my hair with a cotton t-shirt per section. I mentioned that I think in another video, but I'm just going to remind you guys this has helped my drying process tremendously and I totally recommend scrunching out your hair per section. You will thank me later and you would also get more definition. So this is what I do. I part my hair towards my face and I style it that way. This way there's no permanent part, there's no line, there's no awkward parting when you dry your hair. I just simply style my hair facing my face. It's literally that simple. So try it out and it also helps with volume because the, flat, the top of my hair is not going to be flat since I'm styling it the opposite direction that it's going to fall. And then on top of that you diffuse, girl. You're gonna have volume for days. So I use the same exact technique. I'm using my Denman brush as well to style the front of my hair. And then once I'm done, I'm going to scrunch everything up with my cotton t-shirt. All right, and then this is what my hair looks like once everything is put in my hair. There's no part. My edges are laid because I like to do that before diffusing just so they can dry that way. And the curls are really nice and defined and hydrated and I promise you they will last all week. So now I'm gonna go ahead and diffuse my curls as usual and I'll be right back to show you guys my results. And these are my beautiful, voluminous results. But I wanted a little bit more volume that day. I don't know why. But I go ahead. With, but I went ahead and got my little pick. And I started to pick out my curls from the roots only. I've seen girls like actually brush out their curls. And it makes me cringe a little because I'm like, you're ruining all of the beautiful curls. But I guess, I mean, if you like volume, then... You can brush out your hair, I guess, but I feel like that defeats the purpose of sectioning and taking your time. Um, so I just fluff out my roots and you can actually see the difference of the volume once you fluff it out. So I do that on both sides. I don't flip my hair over. I don't go too crazy because it is day one and I do want my curls to last. 
um so i don't go too too crazy i'm gonna go in with the weed add mongongo oil because i always like to seal a style with some type of oil just for some extra shine it's not gonna weigh my hair down or anything like that it's just gonna give me a little bit more shine more sheen so my curls can look extra popping i spray this oil generously because it is a lightweight oil and I like to focus on my ends because those are the oldest parts of my hair so they do get drier quicker than the rest of my hair so I'm just gonna go ahead and scrunch my hair and these are my results my curls are nice defined they're hydrated they're voluminous they are just amazing so I suggest for you guys to try this wash and go out let me know how many days it actually lasted because for me me it can last up to four to five days in the summer if I actually take good care of it while going to sleep so let me know how it works for you and if you enjoy this video let me know give me a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video Mwah.